Hey guys, it's Alice again and welcome to a Primark video. Now I was heavily inspired by my pal Lucy Wood slash I'm copying her because I thought this was a really really cool idea. I'm going to link Lucy's video down below but basically the idea of this video I've picked 10 of my all-time favourite items from Primark and I as you know love Primark the majority of my wardrobe and my belongings are from Primark so I thought it would be really really cool to show you which ones are my favourites. If you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up, thanks so much for watching, subscribe if you want and we're gonna get going because I've got a lot of stuff here. <laughs> First thing, I'm just gonna grab these at random by the way, is a woolly hat and this was something I bought last year, oh there's something in it. Oh, inside I find another hat. But this is a mustard coloured woolly hat and this was around a lot last year. I used to go out and see someone wearing this hat every single time I went out and it basically has a cute little pom-pom and it's just like knitted and I wear it turned up. I haven't yet worn it this season, I will be wearing it soon which is why I've dug it back out and I'm gonna wear this to death no doubt. I really really love how this looks with my black coat and it's just really really cosy. You can't go wrong with Primark hats because they're super super cheap and like even if this goes out of fashion it's not gonna be the end of the world because it was really cheap. Next thing is some workout leggings. I know, me, <laughs> workout leggings? Who even am I? To be honest I haven't been to the gym for two weeks because I've been ill but when I do go to the gym I wear these leggings and I also have some plain black ones from Primark which have like writing down the side. I actually prefer the black ones but they're currently in my wash bin and I don't really fancy digging out some stinky like gym gear so thought I'd show you the clean ones. And these are literally just some workout leggings, they've got like blue and white kind of stripes on, they're high waisted. Um, the other ones that I have do have a little secret pocket at the back so you can put like your keys in there and they're really really comfortable and really cheap so if you're thinking of going to the gym and don't want to 100% fully commit like I didn't <laughs> go to Primark because they're actually really really nice quality and I'm thinking I'm gonna go and pick up some more because these are cheap and I can't seem to find cheap and good leggings anywhere else to go to the gym in. They also have like a mesh thing here. I like it. Okay next thing is kind of homeware and it's very random but this is a pink throw. Now I recently, not even recently, like last year when I was at uni I got into pink and I wanted to add a touch of colour to my bedroom and this was one of the things I found. It's basically a throw and one side is kind of like fleecy and the other side is like a pink pattern, fur kind of texture. It is the softest thing ever and I use this on my chair to make it look a little bit more cute and no doubt this will be going on my sofa when I have my own sofa. <laughs> Primark throws are honestly so affordable and so lovely and if you have a throw addiction like me you can buy as many as you like. <laughs> okay next thing another cozy item and this is a dressing gown. I have a lot of dressing gowns from Primark. I have a few back at home at my parents house but this is the one I have here and I use this all the time. So basically it's Mickey Mouse as a lot of these things will be you'll see in a second. It has two little pom-poms on the like head bit for ears. The inside of the hood is the softest like navy blue ever and then it's just kind of kind of Mickey all the way down. It's got like red piping, it's really really soft, it is quite short, I'm five foot eight and it only just covers my butt which means it is safe for me to wear to run to the bathroom in the middle of the night. Um, but yeah I really really like this, it's definitely more lightweight, it's probably not going to be super suitable in the winter but just to put on top of my pyjamas I really really like this and again it's Disney and it's cheap. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go on to some shoes. I have two pairs of shoes and these are quite boring but very practical. I have these leather, they're not real leather obviously, leather boots and they're just kind of like ankle boots with a tiny heel and they just slip on, there's no zip or anything. I actually have two pairs of these now because I wore these last winter and I wore them to absolute death and they didn't ruin at all. I thought I'd thrown them in the bin. So this winter I went and bought some more. So I had some here at uni. Turns out the ones from last year are still at my mum's house. So I now have two pairs and these honestly last so, so well. They're super cheap, very, very comfortable. Like they never ever gave me blisters to start with and these are just so easy to slip on and they keep your toes warm which is usually what shoes should do. Okay next pair of shoes something a little bit more exciting these are very well loved but these are copper slash rose gold sparkly converse and I haven't actually worn these for a while I feel like these are more of a summer shoe so these have kind of made their way to the back of my wardrobe but 
when it was summer I wore these so much you'll be able to see that they're a bit scuffed I've had to wash them a few times but basically they're like fake converse but they're sparkly and every single time I wear these everyone always says how much they love my shoes and when they're in the sun they catch the light so lovely and yeah I just <laughs> I definitely over wore these but I will definitely be wearing these next summer as well I bought these on such a whim as well it was kind of a joke purchase that I ended up keeping <laughs> okay home weary thing so this is one I actually bought did I buy this two years ago maybe so so this is a home wear item and it's a little chest of drawers it's actually full of makeup right now this is like where I store my makeup I have two of these and basically on the side it's kind of like check pattern with little black drawers and it's basically like a little mini filing cabinet and it's quite roomy in there I love this this was like probably my top purchase I've ever made from Primark I have two like I said and I wish I had more because these are so perfect to put on my desk and store my makeup in and they look cute like I don't really like those acrylic drawers that are clear because you can see everything inside and it looks quite cluttered but I love that this totally isn't so if anyone ever finds any of these in Primark ever again please tell me because I love them and I've been trying to find similar ones <laughs> ever since I had these but yeah it's like a cardboard material but it's really really sturdy and I mean I've had it for like two years now so I love these <laughs> so much oh, oh my god we nearly had a disaster. Penultimate item is a scarf. So this is one of my winter scarves from Primark. I have a lot. I have one that's red as well. But this one I think is my go-to. I couldn't decide. It was between this or the red one. It's like a big blanket. It's like black and white, check print. And it is absolutely huge. So when it gets really, really cold and I have to walk to uni, I like full on wrap myself up in this and I love it a lot. I've also used this as a blanket before when I'm in a classroom that's too air conditioned and I'm freezing because it's nice and big and it works well as a blanket. So yeah, this is really, really good. You can't go wrong with the scarf from Primark. I'm constantly avoiding that section because I know I'm gonna buy more. I don't need more, but I just want more. Wait, that wasn't the penultimate item. I'm wearing the next one. So this next one is some dungarees. So these are the dungarees. I suppose I can try and get up and show you them <sighs> and basically it's black dungarees kind of cottony material they've got pockets it kind of fits in at the waist but yeah these were from Primark and I spotted these and instantly fell in love I do like the denim ones but I feel like they're less dressy and I can dress up or down this kind of set and I totally over wore these so much when I first bought them and I'm so happy we're back in winter so I can wear them again but yeah these dungarees are so so comfortable they feel a lot more expensive than you would think Primark ones would I actually had to double check that they were from Primark because I wasn't quite sure but they are indeed and I love them a lot we're now on to the last item so this one is my Mickey Mouse backpack and I feel like this backpack has become a little bit of a statement for me I feel like this is me in a backpack I was kind of half forced to buy this because I knew I really didn't need another bag but my friend made me buy it and I'm so glad she did. Basically has two little key ring things here, Mickey shorts and a thumbs up. It's got a little pocket and you know what this bag is like a TARDIS. I can fit so much into here. It's actually amazing. I can fit a full size water bottle, my purse, my camera, everything. I love it a lot and I've actually recently bought the gold sparkly version of it because clearly one was not enough and I wanted one that was a little bit more tacky and sparkly. <laughs> so that is it for my Primark favourites. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I actually really enjoyed picking out the things that I love the most. I mean there's so much more that I adore and wear on a daily basis pretty much every time you will see me my entire outfit is from Primark but yeah I hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up let me know what your favorite thing was that I showed let me know if you have it that would be quite interesting to see and I'll see you on Wednesday for another video bye